For many years, the Supreme Court used one of two standards of review in equal protection cases. Laws that discriminated based on suspect classifications like race, religion, nationality, or citizenship had to pass strict scrutiny, a highly demanding standard. Laws that discriminated based on any other classification needed only a rational basis, a lower deferential standard. During the women's rights movements in the 1970s, the Supreme Court grappled with how it should review gender-based classifications. The case of Kahn v. Shevin illustrates that struggle. A Florida law provided a $500 property tax exemption for widows. Based on this law, the Dade County Tax Office denied a tax exemption application from a widower named Mel Kahn. Kahn then sued the Florida Attorney General, Robert Shevin, and sought declaratory relief. Kahn argued that the widow tax exemption violated the 14th Amendment's Equal Protection Clause because it benefited women but not men. Florida argued that the preferential treatment of widows was justified because it helped to balance financial inequities caused by historic economic discrimination against women. The trial court found the law unconstitutional, but the Florida Supreme Court reversed. Kahn then appealed to the United States Supreme Court.